Oh, Bob Cooper. Dougly, Dougly. Bobo's sister. Go, go, sister. What's going on? I was on somebody else's show just, just now and checked on this show and I wasn't supposed to come on right now. It's 7.30, half an hour longer. You guys jumped the gun. But since you're here and I'm here, I might as well start it up. That's what's going on. Made made a few modifications. Ah, oh, Bob Cooper. Hell, Bob, I'll throw you a link. Just a moment, Bob. Wish you and your family Merry Christmas. Your your you guys have been a good friend of mine. Just a moment, Bob. Oh, where's my link? Hey, Peter. There's your link, bro. There you go, man. I just threw Peter Van Dever a link. He's always been good to me. Pete made him angry at me a few times, but he's always been a good man to me. Hey, what's up? What's up? Not much, bro. How you doing? I'm trying to get um Mr. Cooper right now. So yeah, what's up? How you doing, brother? Oh, there's a bunch of trolls. There's right now we have Right now we have thirteen trolls. Already, right now? Yeah, it says it says thirteen trolls watching now. I, I just I just started. How could I have so many people on right now? That's now ridiculous. fifteen trolls. Well, do you did I give you a, a wrench last time? <laughs> yeah. I'm actually I'm surprised sure. I, I'm not. I'm not getting a bunch of nasty comments for that video I made. No, well, you did a good job last night, man. I, uh, I caught. I caught some of you. Caught, I caught some of your show oh, yesterday, talking, and you you were doing pretty good. This afternoon, I, if I get any really nasty comments, I'm just going to delete them. Where I talk, oh, I, I talked a little bit about um, what what was going on with me. As I left the Philippines and in my recovery since I've been back, um, and any any just out of outlandish comments, I'm just going to delete. Yeah, um, that's good. because um, you know. But I, I was just uh, I'm just surprised because I figured there'd be some ridiculous. Um, um, well, not not everybody's against you. You know that. Well, I mean, there's, there's a, a lot of good people out Philippines there. Philippines bound. There's a troll. That's a troll for sure. <laughs> I I just threw I just threw Philippine bound a link if he wants to pop on. That's for sure. That's for sure a troll. Yeah, but but he he's a friendly troll. <laughs> That's a good guy. Hey Bob, I just threw you a link. You know, I my my aunt made a beautiful um tuna casserole. That that was my dinner for tonight, and it was it was quite nice. Matter of fact, I just threw Richard a link to. Maybe maybe he can hop on. Oh, heck. It's funny when I come on, I see all these accounts I've never seen before. <laughs> oh, that's funny. I didn't know Walter had so many different accounts. Who's who's Walter? Will Wonks. Oh, Mr. Wonks? Yeah, he's 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 okay. He he doesn't he's he's been halfway nice to me for a while. 
He's an ass. Okay. <laughs> well, we all we all can be. <laughs> there we go. Um, but no. Um, yeah, Gary is definitely a troll. I agree. Oh yeah, that Jerry guy. I I threw him a link though. If he wants to come on and be a troll, he he can. I'm not sure he he might not be so busy right now though. We got Gogo in the house. He he's a good guy. Hey. Oh. Yeah. But, I probably have you blocked because you're a jerk to people, but I can see your comments for sure. Hey, uh, I, want, I want to be part of your ranch team. I, I thought I'd give you a wrench. Nah. Okay. Oh, ho, ho! Merry New Year to everybody. Hey, brother. We got Mr. Bob Cooper in the house. Hey, you like my new shirt? I don't know, but I can't see your new shirt. You're, it's probably mine, and you're just wearing it. Well, I could have sent it to you. It's part of your church suit. I wanted to show you. Oh. You know, really nice. Well, you're shirt. probably making. Don't don't spill no no pizza on it. Well, I tell you what, this is a really nice silk shirt, but you don't want it. You too oh. famous. No. Well, you know, you you know where silk came from. That's just worm poop. Oh. Um, well, you know that. Everybody we're, knows we're, where, where so so, comes from. So what is the uh, title for today? You know, Kevin's gonna plan dream your about vacation, vacation when, you're on a, when you're on an airplane. When you're flying and you're coming to Mother, Mother Philippines and you get on the airplane, because both of us, are, we're kind of like large people. And wait, where, where do you want to sit when you're on the airplane? Well, Myself, you know, I'm going to sit got, in the uh, back. seat, you know, is big enough, you know, skinny guy. Yeah, for a skinny guy, you can sit anywhere. But for us larger people, we're going to have to sit maybe like on the wing, or yeah. on an emergency yeah. exit, or way in the back. Or if you have, you know, uh, they Peter's. We have they Peter's bank account. We have to have uh, first seat. class. You know, they should discount us extra large seats. Hey, hey, Peter. There's there's a wrench for you. Merry Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> one, 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 one asshole to another asshole. Huh? Asshole? <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, that really smells good right now. <laughs> hey Brian, Merry Christmas, Asshole. brother. Happy New Year. Uh, we, we have Philly in the Philippines here. You guys go check out his channel. We also have Malcolm here. He can't make up his mind. Thumbs up or thumbs down. Well, once you check get out Malcolm. characters on the show, you know. Hey, you guys with the wrench, you guys don't be afraid to use your wrench. If someone's being stupid and and they're not following the guidelines of YouTube or okay. mine, give them a boot or put them in a timeout. Yes. Don't 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 delete them forever. That's my job. But okay. just put them in. Put him in uh, me, five minute answer, timeout is good. Let me answer Go Go Bobo sister. Of course, Terrence is going to get kicked out of the Philippines. Oh, well, they're no, taking he, their time. There's no that. way. There's no way. He has nowhere to go. <laughs> He's a U.S. citizen. He isn't, man. He's got that he damn. Uh, He's got that uh, partial, he want to be a Filipino. No, no, no. He, is, he is a naturalized citizen. I've checked it. 
Huh. Well, he is a naturalized citizen. He he should he should go for a hundred percent Filipino. He has nothing here for him to come here and collect. He, yeah, he 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 doesn't have the money to be in the Philippines. He doesn't have the money to get citizenship. There's black hey, American expat. Cambodia or Vietnam, go get one of those little ladies over there. You can rape and pillage. You know. <laughs> we don't do that, Bob. Hey, what is uh, that bandana on your head? You got a headache? Pause. I think I think Mark Fazio wants to beat the hell out of him. Well, really? I think so. No, well, Fazio. Uh, he. I thought he, he was dead. I thought I, I resurrected him. <laughs> oh God! Did he come out of the storage locker? <laughs> <laughs> that was funny, Bob. I'm sorry, you, you, I, I got my money on Fazio. <laughs> well, they're on separate islands, aren't they? No, they're on the Probably. same island. Are they really? Yes, they are. You mean they, Fazio and, is they a they class? Karen? Yeah. Where is Fazio? What, where is, what He's town is he in? I, I don't know, Bob. I I don't. He uh, nobody. Peter, I don't Peter, care where they're at. They Peter, nobody where cares where I'm at. Yeah, it's kind of. Well, Peter, where is he? He's in. He's Damn in the hole. Yeah, but what town? I'm not there sure you what go. town Merry, he is. Merry Christmas, brother. I, I know he, we talked a little bit about around Thanksgiving. We talked about doing a show together about the whole drama. And we just never made, we never set a, an exact time because of the time zone difference that actually do it. And wow. I mean, I'm, I'm still willing to do it because this, this thing's far from over. So Peter, yeah, right now oh, I'm just, I'm just trying. You guys, you guys that have these new ventures, use it or, like I said, you guys gotta watch my back. Don't overuse use the authority of events. But yeah, you know, block them all. <laughs> no, that's not the job. But yeah, yeah I, I'll plus, tell you plus, 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 can you imagine Fazio and me on the same live stream together? <laughs> <laughs> I can I imagine Fazio on a live stream. That'd be that'd be quite funny. Oh, well, see, because Fazio would bring bring the old PV out, the wild, crazy, back in the Philippines PV. I thought you were oh, back you in mean the, the loud one, the loud Peter V that yells at little children and tells <laughs> the old lady and not feed them no rice every day. That's <laughs> not nice. What's wrong with you? <laughs> well, Peter V even said it. He yelled at children and women and old people. Hey, we actually seen him on video, didn't we, Peter? You were making the video yelling at the kids. Well, hey, don't don't be proud of it, okay? Bob, I mean, he, don't don't make him sound like a rock star. Well, he's only what he is. He is what he is. No, uh, I I like. Fazio, I like. I've always liked him. He's a guy that I've never had an issue with. Um, yeah, he's I okay. Could, I could kind kind of nutcase. One that I could I could actually book. do a video with. Well, I could I'll always do a live stream with Henry. That would be an interesting. Or Ned. Yeah. Fabio oh, had Ned. In love with Obama. I, I thought Ned was good until he until he backstabbed Seth. I thought that was kind of messed up. But yeah, no, that's what something. Video was that? You know, Seth, Seth done nothing to um to to nobody, and and he come out with those stupid um uh, saying that about that that guy that was fooling around with those underage girls. Oh, that's B bot. Yeah. B -bots but, but Ned, Ned if, was talking, talking smack about that. It would be that damn child molester B-Bot. 
Yeah, but there's a lot of people in the Philippines that are too smart for their own good. Well, you know, 58% of the Americans that go over there, they go over uh, there to rape well, them. Hold on, I want to say something real quick. There's, there's too many people in the Philippines, Americans specifically, that think they're freaking experts on the Philippines. I've never seen so many people that think they're constitutional experts of a country they're not even from. What's up, bitches? <laughs> oh, fuck. Who's that? Who's Wait, in the house? Hold on, hold on. Speaking of a self appointed expert. <laughs> hey. What, what, what the the fuck Come on. What's up, Bob C? How you oh, been, man? Now we have what Hemi in the saying? house. Hey, Hemi, you ought to come on. Come on, Just Hemi. To, bring your Hemi ass on here, man. Just to add icing on the cake. Yeah, come on, Hemi. Get on. Hemi's another one. Hemi and, and Jerry have some have something in common. They both they are experts at everything. <laughs> Hemi is an expert. Well, they he are, are right now. They're they're there. We're not. If he was sitting and putting a comment today that he, that he knows he knows everything there is to know about security in Asia. Who said that? <laughs> Hemi. Hemi did? Well, I don't know. Maybe Hemi's got a lot of experience going out to Asia. I'm not sure. He seems like he traveled, does a lot of traveling and stuff. You know. Hey, I didn't know. I just oh, watched really? your, I, I watched your live stream, Pete. I didn't know you had PTSD. Yeah. How did you get that shit? That, that's something I'm not going to get into. Hey, Brian, you oh. are an expert. I mean, you were an expert. There's a reason I've expert. never addressed it. Oh. There's a big okay. reason I've never addressed it. You should be an expert I, in your I said time. in the video, I said I'm not going to go into the details oh, of I it. Just caught, I just caught a little bit of it. Well, hey, pay yeah. attention, okay, redneck? Yeah, yeah. yeah. there's a reason I'm not going to go into the details of it. Dude, but you didn't you didn't serve in the military or anything like that, right? You didn't serve again. I'm not going to go into the details of it. Yeah, no, he was in Vietnam. <laughs> yeah, Bob, he was. And he wasn't in Vietnam. Penis. He's too young to be in Vietnam. Oh, yeah. no, he was in his daddy's penis, experiencing the world. But I will tell you, <laughs> speak of that, I was talking to a guy the other day. Oh, was in his forties, late forties. <laughs> he was telling me, his son is probably late 40s, 40, 48, 49 years old. You know, Vietnam so, didn't stop until 87, so Peter had a chance. What do you mean it didn't stop? Hey, Philly's got a question. Philly's got a question. What's his question? Pete, Philly's got a question. Hang on. What's his okay. question? Okay. I might answer it, I might not. It's about a PTSD. It's not gonna oh, answer. no. First of all, hey, Pete, I, I never said I was an expert on the Philippines. I only give my experiences for my trips coming out. Hey, now, okay. I, I want to see your face when you're talking to me like that, boy. Hey, Peter, answer, answer, um, answer Brian's question. Brian, what is it? I'll, I'll, I'll probably will answer. I don't know. He said, PV, would you consider me an expert on PI? Do you consider Philly an expert on the Philippines? Philly um, the I haven't watched enough of his stuff to say either way. I mean, he's been living there, I think, what, four or five years full-time. Yeah, but I'm, I'm only watching videos. You guys are all like lying to yourself, Peter and Gerald. Hey, pop your faces on. Let's Here's see the that. thing about Brian. Here's pop the thing my about face on, no problem. The only videos yeah, I've let's seen see the are... Truth. Well, I've seen Peter honest, today. Brother. He's an ugly-looking guy. Hey, Bob. <laughs> Every video I've seen of Brian... Hey, there you are, you nasty fucker. <laughs> He's walking up and down Fields Avenue. What's that? Every video of Brian that I've seen, he's walking up and down Fields Avenue. No, he's done, he's done other stuff. Come on, he's done, Peter, let's he's see done, he's done other stuff. Come on. Yeah, Brian, Brian's an expert in, in PI. I'm in the uh, I'm Angela an expert City in the body AC. language. Let's see your face, Peter. You can watch my last video and see my face. <laughs> Come on, you ugly dog. <laughs> Damn. Bob. Hey, Bob, you been drinking or you been smoking or what's up, man? Little I just got out of church. That, that's just got out of church. Yeah. Really? He's been yeah. hanging out. He's been that's hanging good. out with Demigetti too long. <laughs> wait, wait. I, you know, I got a trip coming up to the battle zones, so I got to get ready, man. Get my boots and, and get ready. Now I understand why you consider 
the Philippines is a battle zone, the whole Philippines, Pete? Because at first I didn't quite, I didn't get it. But I mean, now I kind of understand because since you got PTSD, now I understand why you consider the Philippines a battle zone. I mean, it, it's, it's understandable. It is a dangerous place in general. Oh, no, Peter, come on. Don't be a little biatch. Come wait, on. wait. I tell you what. If anybody in the chat room thinks that the Philippines is a dangerous place, uh, uh, let's see, it's not a dangerous place, but number it's one. safest place in the whole wide world. And if you think the Philippines is a dangerous place, put number two. And let's take a little head count just to see. Hey, can I, can I, can I, what about me? Can I say anything? Oh, no. yeah. Hey, go ahead. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> hold on. No, hold on. I, how about, what, what about my vote? Hold on. If you get, if you've ever gotten your head if you ever gotten hit upside your head by a machete type one. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a machete, it's a bolo. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. Wait, see, look, Pete, we got a lot, we got a bunch of ones now. No twos. The two, twos is not is not a safe, is a combat. Yeah, but here's the thing. Hey, here's look. The thing. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Well, no, he said everywhere in the Philippines, the whole country's a combat zone. Oh, that's, uh, what, that's what TV said. Philippines the safest place in the world, man. They got, they Wait, got I'm looking for two. shotguns and front laundry, man. I'm looking for <laughs> two. Well, that's why there's, there's no crime. There's very little crime because they got shotguns. I never seen the any businesses. crime. The whole seven months I was there, I heard an AK in my backyard go out three times. Wait, let's see. Hang in. I'm still looking for twos now, Pete. It's still pretty much ones here. Hey, fly! How you doing, man? Go, go, sisters! Got a sixty-nine. <laughs> Thanks, go. Yeah, he likes sixty-nine. That's why. Oh, that's but anyway, uh, uh, you know, I would just back you. I am. I am I'm zero one. The reason why I wanted to see your face, three you know, and one and a half, huh? I can tell if you're lying, and I can tell you if you're cheating on me. So, <laughs> you know, if you don't show your face while you're live streaming, there's something wrong with you. Oh, I, I see Peter last. I see no. That's the that. thing that I did. Um, for one, I don't want to. For two, it, it bogs down the the data transfer. Oh bullshit! Nope. You're just making up excuses. What does that mean? Data transfer. Another data transfer. What does that mean? It, it slows your computer down if you turns on the um, camera. Who cares? Oh, no, no. Oh, okay. Plus, she's paying the power plus, bill. I'd rather not look at your ugly mug, anyways. <laughs> Who are you talking to, me or Bob C? Both. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I think he needs to pop on a go-go bubble for about thirty-two seconds, and then he'll refrain and he'll pop his picture on. Anyway, so hey Pete, uh, so you're doing a live streaming now. That's kind of cool. Man, so you're not gonna be, like you're not gonna be, you're not gonna be, you're not gonna be talking about the U.S. You're talking more about the Philippines. Is that what you're? Well, I'm, I'm just, take you all for just, a free ride. I, I keep, what's happening is people keep asking me about the Philippines so much that I end up going back to that. Flashbacks. Um, I want to get more towards the U.S., so it's probably, I'm hoping to at least get the 50 50. Mm. Okay. Well, nobody uh, want to look at I, you. I hope to move head. towards. Damn. Potato I hope head. to move towards uh, being a lot more about the U.S. Okay. Put a hat on. Are you still in Austin or you're somewhere else now? I'm in Texas. Oh, oh. Okay, so. Okay, whatever that means. All right, so you're not in Austin. All right. Bob, no, Bob, put a shirt on, man. Nobody uh, wants to I see that. I'm trying to. Oh, oh. <laughs> take Bob, my good shirt off. off. I'm going to go Close the camera, I'm Bob. Close the camera. Hey, go take your insulin. <laughs> <laughs> take your insulin? <laughs> you know, oh, old Doc oh. wants to give me insulin for some reason. I quit taking my diabetes pills. Take, take one of your heart strength <laughs> Come on, Bob. Light that doobie up, man. Pass that joint around. Come on, Bob. <laughs> really? <laughs> oh, oh <shit>. goodness. <laughs> yeah, go kick your insulin. 
Oh. I'll burn one for Peter. How about that? Uh, who, who is Fazio? Fazio is a special person. And I got some trousers on here if you need it. <laughs> no kidding. You you you're a walking you're a walking pharmacist. I'll put you I'll put you to sleep for twelve hours. Hey Pete, yeah, right. Mr. Chin Checker, it's a new troll. He's got your face. Looks like he's got your face on his. Oh, I'm sure. Face on oh, his, his yeah. avatar. <laughs> I like that one. That's a good picture. Oh shit. Oh yeah, these these, these guys do this stupid stuff. Dude, it's cold outside. You're you're famous, you're Peter. That's why. I I care less. You're, you're a famous person. You you should be happy about all these people want to be like you. Yeah, now. <laughs> That's bullshit. It's dark outside. <laughs> yeah. So the weather kind of sucks in Texas right now, huh? Uh, it is kind of crappy. Shit. Are you going to think about going... What's the weather like? It's rainy and fucking storms and shit, it looks like. Rainy? Yeah, they had, they had Love Field the other day. The, uh, they were showing some storms at Love Field. Here well, is also the... Um, I've been having some headaches lately. Yeah. Uh, you're, yeah you're, I know. Please tell your face now. Yeah, I know. Hey, there's that good-looking woman of yours, Gerald. What's going on, woman? Bob C's got the hots for you, D. Be careful. Yeah, sure Bob has the hots for everybody. He's, he's a ladies' man. <laughs> right. There he well, is. Pull out here. Hey, Jerry, did you get my message in Facebook? Oh, about uh, doing a show about the medical stuff or whatever. Yeah. You know, I, I don't know enough about the medical the medical stuff to do a show. Well, you no, always no, go no. on and on and on about it, but I, well, no, I don't go on and on and on about it. All I say, Pete, all I say is that uh, first of all, if you got if you're extremely sick or you got a lot of ailments, you shouldn't move to a country like the Philippines. But if you do, if you do use the healthcare system, you're better off using private hospitals. But also. If you know a lot of people, like my wife knows a lot of people, uh, she does? you know, she, she works while well, she worked with the Surgeon General of the Philippines. So we have a lot of connections. We get a lot of referrals if need be. Bob, what are you so doing? We're connected. In that case, huh? Bob. So again, uh, but I haven't used it much. I only used it a couple of times. Uh, you know, an eye doctor and. Uh, I think what it, that was it. Right. Something else, but that was it. Well, I can tell you this much: in the United States, I've used public hospitals and I've used private hospitals. Right. And I've got the same amount of care. Yeah. You know how too. much it costs me for a private hospital and a public hospital in the United States for the same care? Zero. Well, yeah, because you're on public uh, handouts. I mean, you you get free no, health care, right? What do you mean? Yeah, you got you health are. insurance? You got health insurance in the U.S.? I do. You buy your own health insurance in the U.S.? I've had health insurance care? since I was born. What does that mean? Since you were born? Oh, fuck I've, had, I've had health, health insurance through my dad since I was born. Okay, so you're getting it for free, though, basically. That's what I'm trying to say. You get yes, it for free. Yes, yes. Right. So, yeah. okay. Uh, I mean, so... Yeah, we, of course, uh, you, you got to have health insurance. It's good that you're getting it. There's people like us that buy health insurance here. I've got good health insurance. Yeah, 237 a month. Okay, you, you realize I'm a disabled dependent of a of a veteran, right? You're a disabled. Hey. Okay, hang in. Right, you're a disabled. Hang in, hang in. You're a disabled dependent of a veteran. Right, yeah. I mean, the veterans have really good health uh, health care through the VA. Is that correct? Or health care through the VA? Is that because your father was a, a a veteran, you get free health care? Is that how it works? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, you're lucky. You know, a lot of people aren't aren't as lucky as you are. But if you had to go out and if you had to go out and pay for good health insurance right now, it costs you a lot of money. Gotta work. <laughs> I said. Yeah. Boy, Bob is rolling. You're, 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 you're fortunate. 
you're fortunate that you, your father was in the VA, uh, was in the military. You know, much. Peter could go get a job flipping burgers at Jack and Box for fourteen dollars an hour right now. Thanks, Bob. Hey, hey, hey Pete, to Bob. Are you are you going to pick up? Are you going to work, or what are you thinking about doing, brother? Uh, I, I'm not going to go into details on on what I'm thinking about doing. <laughs> I mean, anything you, that I say uh, will be used against Peter me. Tonight. <laughs> I mean, you might as well work, make some money, dude. I mean, it, it's it's you know if you well, got the opportunity that, of doing that. Yeah, that there. I mean, I have I have some. There's a situation, and there, there's some stuff that's going on. Mm -hmm. Um, and I'll just leave it at that. Oh, yeah. Right. Don't, okay. don't tell too much when Bob is I, down. I'm the war is on in Texas. Here. They're all turning. I have to uh, be very careful on what I share. Hold up. Oh, okay. Yeah, you know. Does that make sense? No, that's cool. Yeah, that's cool. a lot of sense to I'm me. I'm just saying, if you have an opportunity to work and it doesn't affect, say, whatever, uh, you know, whatever monies that are coming in now to you, then do it. You know what but, I'm saying? Yeah. Well, it's and, not you know. only that, but it's the stupidity of of anything I say online gets twisted and used against me. Right, right. No, I understand. That's so cool. I, have to, I have to be careful. Like that, that video I put out, there was a reason that I didn't put it out for so long. Mm. Never addressed that issue. Yeah. And the only He's reason I'm really in the closet, it, that's why. The only Six. reason I, kill you. The only thank, reason thank I really addressed that, it is because I I'm seeing a, a pattern that's kind of alarming. What what pattern and, is that? Gay pattern? What? Um, a pattern. Not not just with what's going on with me, but also just with the with, with all these guys going to the Philippines. They go over there, and then they're having crises, and they with no support. Well, a lot well, less support than I had. Okay, well, it's called not planning before you go to the Philippines. That's well, no, no, I'm talking oh. about. If if you have if you have a, a crisis, where, and I'm not talking about a physical crisis, uh -huh. and and you're not connected to the VA, there is no help. Well, it, well, it depends. You have a VA for Americans in Manila, you know. It depends who you know in the Philippines, too, Pete. I mean, you know. No, I, if you listen, know some of the locals, you got connections with locals. There's help there. Just no, no. Know. What, listen, to what I'm about to say. Yeah, uh -huh. let, let's just let's talk about PTSD since that's what the issue is. You have oh, PTSD. Oh, let's say boy. you have civilian PTSD. Bob, do me a favor. <laughs> shut the fuck up. Bob, you got you, dog, you got man. put in your place. Oh man. Let's you mean, say you. Pete just made you his bitch. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> Peach pie. <laughs> I need to roll anyways, but <laughs> no, we're just yeah. talking with you, Pete. We're like, what are you uh, Come on, Pete. You're right. doing PTSD. Um, you and you don't have any support system there. They have a very small unit at St. Luke's, hey. and that's it. All right. So, do you, I mean, do you get uh, how how? Let me ask you a question. I don't even know much about PTSD, but how is there like different levels of PTSD? Yeah, there is. Degree, but I'm talking about if you if you need to go inpatient, there's a small unit at St. Luke's, and that's uh, it. Okay, if you need to go, small unit. They're gonna have to get you to the states if you need anything. All right. But you were, not, you, you were in the in Philippines, Philippines for like six years or something or seven hey, years. Hey, I got a roll, but let me tell you something. Uh -huh. Mental health is a joke in the Philippines. Well, I mean, the Philippines isn't for you, I guess. You know, I mean, what can you do? Yeah. That's it is. It's I, not for you. That's the other reason I, got, I kind of wanted to open up that discussion. Anyways, I got a roll. I got to I gotta get scared. where I'm going. Yeah, I just want to go on. Stay away, everybody. Peter, right. this is good. Where are you? Now Bob can be disruptive. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye, Peter B. Beat off, Peter. All right, man. <laughs> Later.
You going? <laughs> Stick around for another 10 or 15 minutes, Pete. No, you're on. You're on the the thing is, he, All right, he has PSYD, not PTSD. He's never been to war. He collects a welfare check for 300 bucks a month. That's why he can't afford the Philippines. And uh, as far as it goes, Medicare and all that stuff, he says that his father uh, uh, did whatever it was. Dad's dead. I don't know how that relates unless he's been on the check ever since day one. I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't. I didn't have anybody in the military in my family. Well, actually, my no, uncle was. No, did but, you just um, hear me, man? You know, he he's never worked a day in his freaking life. Were you in the military, Bob? Were you in the military? No, hell no. No, I was never old enough. Oh, okay. You mean by the time you hit 18, uh, the draft was over, right? Because the draft yeah, was over by the time I hit 18. Over. Yeah, they still accepted guys to go in if you wanted to work for free. You know, but uh, hmm. I was always in to make money in a bank, man. I always carried two jobs all my life until I broke my back and neck when I was 30. Yeah, I mean, one of the reasons I didn't go in the military is I wanted to make some money and get an education, so that's why I didn't go in. <clears throat> well, I, I didn't care about education. I just love my two jobs, you know. Mm. Uh, you know, you, you don't have to have an education to be the president of the United States, you know. <laughs> is that what you're shooting for, Bob, is president of the United States? <laughs> President really? of Facebook, yes. You know. Oh, okay. All right. I'm the Facebook doctor. If you uh, pull up my uh, profile, you'll right. see that. Let's, let's don't pull up nothing or take nothing out either. <laughs> pull out. <laughs> don't ever pull out. Uh, take just, just chill a little bit. And quit wearing well, my who clothes. Else can we scare? Who else can we uh, scare off the line? When the shit gets sick, they run. This is pretty much it, Bob. Bob Cooper chases Peter V off the show. Come on, Bob. What's going well, on? Well, you here? know what? He's a liar, man. He's a Come liar, on. man. How do you know he's, he's a liar? He's wife beating, uh, child non-support uh, son of a bitch. You know what I mean? That's what he is. Uh, tell the truth. Tell the truth when you're on here, man. Well, Don't he's got those secrets. He's got to deal with all that. We don't have to deal with that. It's he's he's the one that's got to deal with that. So I personally, yeah, but he's full uh, of secrets. That's why I can't admit the truth. Well, Hold on, sir. yeah. So yeah. So what's next on our agenda? We're gonna talk about you, Bob. Let's see yeah, what your deeds are. Put you on the microscope. Let's see what the skeletons in your closets are. Okay, I'll tell you hundred percent the truth. What do you want to shoot for now? See, Nothing. Were, you, were, were you a lady boy before? That's that's no. the first question. Are you no. sure? Are you sure? Uh, hey, I, I dressed up in my mom's uh, <laughs> uh one time, and my ex old lady's, uh, you know, Chinese girl. Silk outfit. I, okay. I think more than once. All right. See, I knew something. I knew you were up. I knew you had some skeletons in your closet, Bob. See? Now, do you well, feel better? The, the kids came to my house on Halloween, and I was dressed up as a nurse with a beard. They knew <laughs> something was going on. Right. So, see, now you feel better as you come out to us and tell us your story and stuff like that. I'm sure. Uh, yeah. What else should we talk about? That's that's all we need to know. That's yeah. enough. <laughs> Any special things? No, no. Are you Come into on, blow up dolls? Let's or get the what thumbs else? up here. Let's get the, all the thumbs up going. Oh shit! Go I did a thumbs down. down. Sorry about that. I did a thumbs down. Damn, buddy. Why why would you do that? I did a thumbs down. Let me switch it back to thumbs up. All right, here we go. All right. All right. Yeah, there should be about thirty thumbs up and one thumb or down. That's Peter. Well, Peter, hell, we, we got we got at least we got around almost thirty people in the house, and they're all coming to see you, Bob. Well, is Gerald in the Philippines? No, I'm in Chicago. I'm in Chicago, Bob. Motherfucker, put your face on there so I can read your lips. You I'm in Chicago, there? Bob. I'm in Chicago. Okay, read, that's the number one this? guy right there. Can you read number your number one? one? <laughs> <laughs> number one guy. <laughs> and I'm number two. And let's see yours. 
Mr. Kevin? Kev's like number five or six or something like that. Yeah, mm -hmm. but I always come up on top. Never forget that. There we go. Well, I like you on top. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I want to be on top, never on the well, bottom. On here's the a neutral. troll. Here's a new troll. Oh, we New Year. That's a new troll. Never seen that one before. Huh? Oh. What are you looking at? Oh, oh, oh you looking at? I'm looking yeah. in the chat room. It's a new guy. New yeah, troll. Th that's a new. That's a new guest. Welcome to our show. Welcome to our show of chaos. Chaos. <laughs> our show of chaos and mayhem. What's there this? We we're, we're, we're all family here. <laughs> Okay, let's see here. What's your show called again? Damn, Bob. Uh, our vacation to the Philippines. What okay. do we have to vacation do to get there? Wow, Jerry, that was nice. I'm still number one, huh? Uh, what's that? Well, I see you flipping so, somebody off. No, that was Bob. He wanted me to flip him off or something. Oh, wow. Huh? <clears throat> Google Chrome. Yeah. Google Would you Chrome. steal that computer, Bob? Would you steal that computer, man? Well, uh, Bob, it's, it's, he got enough computers in the house. I think he got three or four of them in the house. I bet you. I bet you, Bob sells hot computers out of his house. <laughs> out, out of his um. <laughs> I could. Uh, Let's see here. Let's see what everybody's saying about me. Google well, Chrome. I'm, I'm, I'm sure they're saying a lot of nice things about you. Well, you know, Rain Man, he's gay anyway. Yeah, he is. I, I thought Rain Man was like a friend of yours. Well, he was, but sometimes, you know, he gets on my nerves. But he's all right. <clears throat> okay. Uh oh. Now, what are you guys doing on my computer? Only Google the best. Chrome. Yeah, yeah, it was getting good. I, I don't know why Peter had to leave, man. What time is it? Chicken maybe, head. Maybe the library's it closed or something. Heads. I don't chicken know. <clears throat> That's boring. Well, I think it, it should be the. I think Texas and my time, Texas and here Chicken is the boy. same time. Texas is on Central Time, right? Yeah, yep. same as mine. Same as us. Yeah, it's same as us. Same as us, huh? Yeah, Peter's okay, you know. He, he's not bad. Heart on fire, baby. Good morning to you. Well, Welcome to up. our show. Always. <laughs> we always on. welcome nice ladies to our show. <laughs> Full of beans tonight. Oh, man. Ever Bobby, we have a nice lady on the show to talk nicely. Huh? We have a we have a nice lady on the show, so don't oh, scare do? her. Where's the lady at? Well, hey, pay attention. What are you doing? Are you well, playing you the know. game? Because you're not looking. Well, if we got a lady on the show, why don't you put her on live stream and let's see what it is. I'm, I'm sure she's afraid of you, Bob. All girls are afraid of you. Well, they should be. Yep, they should be. You know, they're scared of Santa Claus. Ho, ho, ho. Ho, 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 ho. So, what are we doing? Five, five, five. Hi, Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. Bye, humbug. Hey Bob, I hope you had an, I have, hope you had a good Christmas. Oh, I did. Best I, I had a I live had. show on Christmas. Then it Best wasn't a long. Best Christmas I ever had. Guess what I got for Christmas? Um, a TV, a barbecue, and a vacuum cleaner. <laughs> yeah, for so you could cook and clean up your mess with that that you make when you when you're cooking. You know, what I don't understand is Friday is garbage day, and I put out all my cans on the street because we got to wheel them out to the street. And then uh, 
they didn't come by and get our garbage today. It's Friday. Uh, maybe because of the New Year's coming up. No, I'll tell you what it is. It's a Mexican town, and everybody goes to Mexico for two weeks, and they just haven't came back. Mexicans run our garbage trucks, see? Oh. Huh. So when they come back, whenever that's going to be, I'll be on the first. Then they'll fire up their dumpster trucks and go out, pick up all the garbage, which is terrible because I got a can full in the living room and a can on the porch and a can in the but kitchen. Do you, do you separate your cans like, um, you know, your, your cans, your metal, your papers, your garbage? Yeah, yeah. If it was light out, I'd show you all it, you know. Well, that's Put the good. green waste in the green can, you know, all the leaves. Yeah. Hey, Bob, yeah. pretty soon the uh, Americans are going to have to get on these garbage trucks and uh, pick up these jobs, man, because we're not yeah. going to be letting any uh, foreigners in. So, you know. Yeah, it's really going to suck when all the Mexicans die in California. Yeah, as soon as Mexicans all die off, man, we're going to have to go pick our own groceries. Work in the fields and stuff? Did you ever, yeah, uh, do, did. Did you ever do migrant work before? I did that when I was a kid, you know. I did that. <clears throat> I did too. I worked on my, uh, my stepfather's uh, cantaloupe farm. Oh, yeah? And I hate cantaloupe, man. I've, seen, I've touched thousands, millions of them. Yeah. Yeah, we we had an oak uh, farm um, next. Uh, like one one season we have uh, <laughs> rice, and then the next season we have okra. And boy, we had a we had a plant okra, we had a cut okra, and that's some that's some nasty vegetable. Yeah, that's a nasty vegetable. I mean, uh, okra is really good, tasty. You know, depending on how much you love well, that. I like, I like deep fried okra. I don't like plain okra. Yeah, fried okra is good. When yeah, and stuff fried it in oil or air fryer, really good. Yeah, but if you eat okra plain, it's slimy Ooh. and it's nasty. But yeah. if you add um, vinegar to it, it's good. But Yuck. okra plain—that's <laughs> that's a slimy vegetable. Pickled okra. I, I I never knew. You could um, eat okra outside of frying because <laughs> we always had deep fried. <laughs> we, I never ate okra before um, when it wasn't deep fried. <laughs> yeah, I like deep fried okra and I like that purple stuff. What is that called? Uh, eggplant? Eggplant. I love that. Oh, yeah. I, I like it Filipino style, but I like Italian um, eggplant parmesan. I like. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. And That's stuffed, nice, too. Stuffed bell peppers. Mm. Yeah. That's delicious, man. Hey, can I have three more stuffed bell peppers and extra cheddar cheese? Thank you. Oh. Well, if you got a big bell pepper, that's pretty good. But we try to grow bell peppers um, at the farm, and the, the insects got it pretty good. Oh, I didn't know insects like bell pepper. Uh, they they eat everything. Is that in the Philippines or? Yes, sir. Uh, don't say sir to me, old man. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Bob, I, you're almost my same age, so I don't know why you're laughing. Uh, in fact, you look older than I am. Old? You look older than me, so don't laugh. Well, it's because I got this chin hair going on. And whatever. I like to see you with a beard. I did last week. You you seen me, and you guys told me to get a razor and shaved it off. As you can see, I shaved it off. Yeah, but we want a full beard with mustache. Oh, please. I'm not so no when you dribble <laughs> when you dribble your boogers, the gall gets stuck in your stash. <laughs> yeah, that's 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 so nasty because you got a whole bunch of collective growing underneath. <laughs> You guys hey, kind of look like no matter, you could be brother. brothers and stuff. Hey, Kevin, hey. You, and, you and Bob look like you could be brothers. We all and brothers you're in third the wheel, right? Third wheel, Gerald. 
He's her third will. Hey, Bob, uh, you got any siblings or are you the only one, man? Oh, I wish I was the only one, but no, I got a sister in the uh, living room and I got an older brother. He's an asshole and he lives about 50 miles away. And I got a little I like baby you, brother. I like your brother, I've Bob. I've him for 25 years and he lives 10 miles that way. You know? I, I thought your brother was <laughs> kind of cool. Up? What's up, man? How come you don't get how come you don't get along with your family, Bob? Well, <laughs> my older brother thinks he's a biker and I hate bikers. Oh. You could pass and, for a biker. Uh, and my baby brother is a pig. I mean a cop, and I just don't fly that way. You know. Oh, because he might bust you, he might turn you in for selling drugs or something. Yeah, like that. he might bust me for smoking a cigarette. <laughs> well, let's no, he's a pig. He's a pig. There's something wrong with him, you know. I mean, I think he's a chomo personally. You know, but that's my own thought, you know. What's going on, Ken? Mm. Yep, chomos and cops all belong together. Oh. Hmm. Uh, Ken had a good Christmas. Everybody had a good Christmas. Happy New Year and good Christmas. I so, Gerald, what do you get for Christmas, man? What's that, Bob? I didn't hear it, man. You went, you clocked out. What <clears throat> did you get for Christmas besides BJ? <laughs> Man, that's pretty nice. That's, that's, yeah, that's what else wild. do you need? Yeah, Bob. I mean, what else do I need? No. Um, hey, we don't really. Man, I wanted you know, to see the facial expression, man. Come on. Basically, Bob. I mean, I'm too old for gifts and stuff. You know, and my wife. We don't really buy each other gifts. We just go out to dinner and uh, you know just hang out and do stuff. We don't really. We're not really uh, people no that. Idea, uh, buddy. That celebrate Christmas. We're not that big on Christmas. Yeah, I'm normally not like that <laughs> but I got to play around. Hey, Lars, I'm go to my Facebook like it, and you know. say, hey, and I'll throw you a link. Who's coming on? Lost Nomad. Who in the hell's he that? He was on another show earlier that I, I was listening to. A uh, bunch of Brits was on. Now, I, I can't fly that way, man. Their language just throws me off, you know. Yeah, but it was it was a good show, though. Like Roberto, his language, and Alloy's language, and Popeye's language. They all throw me off. I can't watch that crap. What do you mean? Rob Roberto speaks signalist. What are you talking about? Yeah. But... I just don't understand his mentality right now. Oh, well. Whose mentality? <clears throat> Roberto's. Oh, uh, I don't know. Yeah, that's what I say, too. I don't know. Yeah. Well, maybe you ought to just try a little bit, buddy. You just so, so talk to your symbols. Symbols. Like Symbol. girls, symbols. Yeah, man, you, know? you should talk to your siblings, man. I, I I get along really well with my brother. You should you should uh, you should uh, try to connect with your siblings. Man. All right, lost nomad. I get uh, along better with my new friends on the web. Really? I mean, did you make ever ever made an effort to uh, to get together with your siblings and get better relations with your siblings? Oh, dude, me and my older brother would. Rip out off each other's heads, shit down their throats. All right, so beat the shit out of each other and get it over with. Yeah, get it out of your system. Well, <laughs> I got a broken back and neck. I've been there and done that so many times. It just oh. hurts. All right, well, take a baseball bat to him or something like that. You no, know, I had a I had a friend that took a baseball bat to his older brother when we were kids. Like you know the yeah. you know the little souvenir baseball bats when you go to a yeah little sluggers yeah yeah the little sluggers what that yeah. was interesting uh we were like I think we were in tenth grade so we must have been like 16, 15, 16. and what happened was his brother uh, his older brother which was like twenty eight lived at home he lived in uh, you know the walk up attics that was his bedroom up there and he had some he had some uh, I think mental issues you know. Uh, but he kind of knew what he was doing, but he had some issues. And then yeah. one day, man, he was pissed off at my friend. Uh, 
and he was kind of fucking with us, his older brother. So I left the house. I go, hey, man, I got to go. Next thing yeah. I know, a fr my friend called me up about maybe 30 minutes later. He goes, hey, man, because I just beat the shit out of my brother. The ambulance took him away. I'm like, what do you mean? But well, now point, fireman's coming. No, that's down the street. But hey, man, you know what happened? He, uh, the guy, uh, his older brother grabbed him by the neck, apparently, when he were in the kitchen. And he let him go. And then my friend went to his bedroom and his brother followed him. And he had that little baseball bat I gave him behind the door. Oh, and when, nice. his looked in, when his brother opened the bedroom door, looked in, my friend just clocked him over the head a couple of times. And his Killed brother his fell, in, fell in the room. And my friend locked the door, closed the door, locked it, started beating the shit out of his brother. He went and out. On the ground. His brother got out. Somehow his brother made it out of the room. Went to across to the next to the neighbor across the street. And my friend still beating the shit out of him on the side door. And yeah. Was, yeah, they called the cops and uh but it was cool, man. Uh, I mean, you know, the ambulance came, took the took his older brother away, and uh uh you know, it's crazy shit, man. Uh that was well, see, the thing yeah. is with me, you know, since we're <clears> big, <throat> we're me and my brother is both big, about the same size, but I, I'm a foot taller than he is, you know, and, and so there's a disadvantage right there. And, and the other disadvantage was I overheard him tell my mom that uh, he hurt his back uh, and uh, he hurt his foot. So what I would do is I'd take my right foot, jam it down on his sore feet. And then he turn around and I kick him in the fucking back, and well, then I keep on right. kicking him in the back until he's dead, dead, dead. Well, that's kind of like a right. pussy, move, isn't it? Isn't it like a pussy move? You know? Yeah, no, Bob, it really it isn't. Come on, you know, it I mean, really yeah. isn't because he already. Uh, I've been disabled for twenty years, and all he has to do is get me on the ground, and kick me in the right spot, and I'll stay there for the rest of my life. Oh, okay. So you mean you'll be like uh, disabled in a wheelchair? You mean like a para paraplegic or something? If Probably somebody... like paraplegic. Oh, I'm not. Head to yeah. toe. And be in bed for the rest of my life, shoved in the corner of a mental state institution hospital. You know. Oh, you get three squares a day and free housing and whatever. Yeah, and the nurse plays with your Peter. <laughs> What's yeah, you go? Go. you'd be in heaven. You'd be in heaven, Bob. <laughs> hey, Ed, did you ever get your live stream on? Because now you have to outdo um your bro. So, oh, Ed's going to be a competition now, Big Kev. He's got he's going he's doing live streams. Well, I, I think oh, I think know, him and him Bob, Bob, Bob. Bob. Him have competition. Oh, Bob got bumped off. Oh man. What happened to Bob? Nothing. Bob. Bob's right here. No, Must be that don't. cheap internet in California or something. Can y'all hear me? Yeah, I can hear yeah, you. Yeah, buddy, I can hear you. All right, let's check. What's up, Jerry? How you been, man? I ain't seen that much, time. Lost. How you doing? Good, good, good. What's up, Kevin? I haven't talked to you in a while either, man. How you been? I'm doing pretty good, man. I, I said hi to you on that um, British show. Yeah, yeah I, I said I saw you. I said hey to you. Yeah, I hadn't... Um, kind of been away from uh the youtube thing here for a little bit so i hadn't really yeah. seen what's going on at all here lately uh, i like i like to go so i like to go over to those british guys and and say hey to them once yeah, in a those, while um, them guys are uh, a lot of fun they just like to hang out and have a good time and yeah socialize that's what it's really all about i mean bk right? goes over there i go over there yeah um, those those guys are pretty cool can't you can't understand a word they say, but but they're, they're pretty fun. <laughs> what happened to Lost Nomad? He's still here. What's oh. up? So what's going on, Lost? I'm here. No, that's all right. Oh, hang on, my Bluetooth just screwed up. Hang on, sorry. Uh, all right can you hear me now sorry yeah yeah we can hear you For some reason my bluetooth decided to disconnect did it do it again son of a bitch hmm. no there, there's a couple of british sorry. channels uh, um that i go to that that i'm sub to big k and i and go over there and hang out bs with them 
Yeah, it's a group of a bunch of good dudes and, and gals and uh, yeah, a lot of a lot, lot of women. Of, yeah, they do a lot of karaoke and stuff. We can do live. I oh well, a lot lot of practice, buddy. <laughs> when I first started, uh, I was a newbie too, boy. Not not easy to do at first. A lot of lot of baby steps. <laughs> Just ask Bema, tell him to tell him to hold your hand and 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 guide you through, guide you through it. Yeah, he's got experience with doing live streams. Yeah, Bema's <laughs> old. Bema's old. He's experienced, but more experienced than me. Um, I, I, I did. Hey, did Bema leave already? Did he go to Singapore? I do not know. So yeah, I, I don't keep up with that guy at all. So no, I don't know. I don't go to that channel. I got blocked. I got blocked about two oh. weeks ago. Yeah. Well, good job. I don't even know. Bob. What did I say? Job, Bob. I can't remember what I said. It must not have been. I don't think it was anything major. But he blocked me for some. He is, I think he was drunk and pissed off about something, so he just blocked me. Maybe because I didn't get to his uh, super chat fund. Who knows? Huh. Could be that. Yeah, I mean, Jerry, you give to everybody. Why don't you give them? No, money? actually, I, I don't lost. I don't give to everybody. That's where you're wrong. You give to everybody. That's okay, tell I me mean. who do I give to, lost? <laughs> Since you know everything about me, tell I me who you who do I give to. Everything about Go ahead. You. I know all Go ahead, lost. Wait, tell me, lost. Who do I give to? Who do I live? Who do I give to? I, you know, Jerry, I have I have zero idea. Yeah, you know. <laughs> If, if, I'll tell you what. If, if you've given to somebody, I have. I have no idea. I mean, no, I, I give to a few. What are you people. giving to? Not not much, but I give to a few. Shit. I hate you. Don't. I, what do you? I want something. <laughs> well, you're already, you're already making big money, Kev. You know, so whoa, I whoa, whoa, seen wait that. you don't need my money. Jerry gives to other people, but he don't give to Kev. That is not right. Yeah, man. that's what? not right. <laughs> Man, come I, on, I, I need to see some money soon, though. That'd be nice. I didn't know, I didn't know Lost Kevin. was watching me. Lost, see, Lost is looking Kevin. in the background, watching Kevin me when I come like on live stream. Kev is your biggest streams. supporter. Kev is your biggest supporter, and you don't want to even donate. Kev is my, yeah, well, what can I tell you? You know, <laughs> I, I give him moral support. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, you do. Hey, I, I appreciate that, too, you know. Yeah, you know, there, there are a support. few guys out there that do give me support, like help me out, like doing some stuff, and I do appreciate that. Money you can can buy happiness, you know. There you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah I can. What are you? What the fuck are you talking about? Money you can, can buy, buy happiness. temporary joy. Temporary joy. Yeah, and joy to the world, baby. <laughs> well, everybody's messing with PA Trucker. I thought PA Trucker was like a a good guy. Oh, he's, he lost his ranch. Ah, that's hey, what he he, he's hey, I, put I out the ranch. A lot of ranches, and I am rotating. Look, look at um, <laughs> uh, Raymond like a Ray man's comment. <laughs> funny. I, I give a Raymond a wrench. I give a couple of hey, hey, hey Kev, you might have to take Rain Man's wrench away, man. Look at the way he's talking <laughs> shit, you know. Take his wrench away so I can block him real quick or put him on a timeout. <laughs> no, no, that's all right. We'll, we'll, we'll leave him alone. <laughs> no, I'm just, I'm just rotating the wrenches. Rotating the wrenches. The, the yeah. problem with that, what the problem with Rayman's comment is, uh, Jerry. I mean, you just, I mean, that's that's pretty easy. You know what I mean? I mean, that's not no, a I know, I know. You have to give her. Right. I I walked into that one. There you go. <laughs> but it's Rain Man. You know, he's my bro. I can't I can't mess with Rain Man. Everybody knows that. Oh, he knows where you live. Yeah. Out. Everybody seems to know where everybody lives. A big deal. I'm on the internet, man. So you can just Google me, and you'll find out where I live. Not a big deal. <clears throat> yeah, I know. Like someone's gonna come to your house, right? Well, I had one threat of somebody's come and beat me up, but he never showed up. <clears throat> oh man, where do you live? I'll come beat you up. Chicago. I even offered to come and pick him up at the airport, but he still didn't uh, show up. I want Chicago <laughs> pizza. <laughs> I don't know. 
Uh, that, that's pretty good. I, if someone ever threatens me, I'll I'll uh, I'll do the same thing. I'll pick him up there. Pick him up at the airport. Why not? Yeah, mm -hmm. I'll film it. Just hey, left all there. around. <clears throat> Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, brother. It's going pretty good. Another day, man. What happened? To welcome, Boom welcome Bob? to the show. I don't know. He got bumped off, or did he? Really? He didn't get nobody bumped him. I mean, no, he just like got he knocked just like off Peter. Just get up and yeah, walk soon, away. As soon as I, uh, as soon as I came on, he, um, he maybe he doesn't like you, Lost. I don't. <laughs> maybe, probably, maybe he don't. I don't know. I've only Man, lo times, but... Lost is chasing people away off your stream, Big <laughs> Kev. <laughs> Damn, man. That's why I didn't have to get on early. I knew I would have ran OPV off. Hey, yeah, uh, Peter. Uh, he he looks like he's doing pretty good. He gained a lot of weight. Well, if they, if gaining weight's doing pretty good, then uh, damn. Kevin, well, compared to what he uh, used to look like. Life. <laughs> I mean, he was getting bones, and now he he's look. Hey, like... Lefty, how you doing? <clears throat> uh... What's up, Lefty? All around. Yeah, uh, hell, doing, doing good. Kevin, you got like thirty people watching, but there's only like four people talking. A lot of lurkers. A lot of lurkers. I know. Lurkers Let's see how many participants. There. One, two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine participants, and like you know, twenty-one lurkers. Yeah, well, that's okay. We get this is a spectator sport. <laughs> <laughs> No. Rain man, <laughs> dumpster diving is gonna be an Olympic sport. Rain man, really? <laughs> be careful, Rain man. He'll he'll he got a wrench. He'll, well, I got a wrench. Get, he'll mess with you. So we'll we'll x each other out if we we both got wrenches. Here, I'm gonna say something. Block me. Do it. Do it. Or time me out. Whatever the hell it is. I don't even know. Now, nah, Rain Man, you got to really be out of line for him to block for him to time somebody out. I don't, I don't, I don't think I've ever seen him time anybody out. Who oh, Rain Man? Yeah. Well, he can't. He, I, he, he just now get the wrench. Oh, he just got the wrench. Oh, I thought he had yeah. this wrench here for a while. I've no. seen him. I've seen him with a wrench on on a couple of other people's live streams, but I, oh. I've never seen him time anybody out. Well, like I said, um, when you if you guys get the wrench. Pay attention on the show, and if somebody's being stupid, well, put them on a timeout. All the time, you're going to gain weight. I mean, you even got to go to the dumpster. You're going to gain weight while you eat the fast food all the damn time. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah, fast food really will fucking put on some pounds, man. <clears throat> well, don't need to block them, but I'm talking about like that five minute timeout. He doesn't even do that. Hey, 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 I'll I'll decide who needs your rent, who don't need a rent. Remember that. This is this is a big Kevin show. This, this is this isn't like who who cares show. So big Kev, you got any plans for New Year's or what's up? You know, we'll we'll probably have a show this this New Year's, just like what we did last year. Hopefully, we'll get um. I I I like to have Seth come on. We had a show last year with Seth and Peter and Bama. Oh, Seth's a single man now. He ain't gonna catch him on. on the is he in California or, or is he back in the Philippines now? I have no idea. Or is he still in uh, Taipei? That that was his last time. Last time I saw a video on him. I don't know. Well, you you know more than I do, apparently. No, I, I really don't. Uh, I heard a rumor that, that somebody said he's back in California, but it could just be a rumor. Yeah, <clears> these <throat> rumors, boy. Everybody is maybe just an expert. A, maybe <clears throat> trying to finish his uh, his wife's citizenship. 
But why would he do that? Mm, why wouldn't he? It don't sound like it's a bad thing. Yeah, that's true. Oh, yeah. You know what? Yeah. He probably should, actually. Yep. But I think she would have to be there for him to finish it up. Yeah, yeah, she'll definitely have to be there. Yeah, because she she'll have to go into an interview and all that kind of stuff. So yeah, actually, my uh, my wife finally finished her. She's a finally a full fledged citizen. Here. Oh yeah, how long did it take? Lost six years. No, no, no. I'm talking about when you put in. We just filed a couple of days ago. We sent in the application for citizenship. Oh, okay, how long did yours get it? How long did it take? Oh, uh, man, I guess it was about six or seven months before you yeah. were able to take the test. Six to eight months, they, they say six to eight. I would say it six to 12 cool. nowadays, but, you know, that's Man, cool. there was a shit ton of people there at that, um, at the, um, the, the swear-in ceremony thing. Or oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, a whole bunch, I'm sure. Yeah, I did mine back in 77. There must have been a good 30 or 40 of us when we oh, all got like, sworn in. I think there were supposed to be 550 people there. And like Damn. a few didn't make it for whatever reason, and I think it was 519. Wow. Was that a basketball stadium? It was a big, like, kind of theater thing. Yeah. Ed, what what did your – oh, your ex-wife got her citizenship in a year? Yeah. Yeah, six to eight months, but it could take about a year nowadays. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. I I mean, I, I joked around. I joked about that Seth thing. I mean, I have no idea what his uh, mm. what his, his deal is. Yeah, I bet he. I bet he came back home, probably visit his family or something. You know, probably took a little time to figure out what he wants to do. I'm surprised yeah, he. I'm surprised he shut his. I mean, not shut the channel, but I'm surprised. Why would you not leave the videos up? I mean. I would have just oh, left like, did he did he completely remove his channel? That's what it no, I mean he just took the videos off. The channel's still there, but there's just oh. no videos on it. Uh -huh. So I, I I guess what do you do? Did he go all go private? I guess the videos all, all all weren't I think he put them all on private or something. That's why you don't now see him. Now that you say that I haven't looked at him in so long, I don't even know. Hey Linda. Oh yeah, channel has no videos. I'm surprised he don't even want to advertise his um his website or whatever. Yeah, it's pretty well. I would have just left it up. I mean, at least you got some kind of money coming in. Yeah, good yeah. He wants to. You know, I used to watch this guy, one of the first like YouTube vloggers in the Philippines that um so yummy Kaya. He did the same thing years ago. He just whatever reason he just took everything down. No, yeah. no. Yeah. Waste of, you know, that took a long time to do. What well, took a long time? Uh, to do all them videos. Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, I don't so. know if he uh, wasn't making money on them anymore, if he just don't care. I mean, you know, everybody's got their own personal reason. I yeah, mean, you're so still making something. Out, man. I, I uh, used to watch that dude like almost 10 years ago now. Hmm. But yeah, I mean, you know, he's got his own personal reason, whatever. It's not, it's not like he was slowly moving away from YouTube anyway, so. And who knows? I mean, if he wasn't even getting the views anymore, then, you know, wasn't making money on you. I mean, I have no idea. But, you know. Yeah, it's hard to say. I mean, you get, a, you get a lot of these, you get a guy, I mean, there was just this one dude. How about that dude that went to... Uh, Angela City for a couple of months got about three four thousand subs or three thousand subs and then just shut his channel down oh, or all channels that, down. that hmm. Terry dude yeah the, the dude from Ohio <laughs> shut no. it down yeah I heard he was what in, did he do uh, Angela City or whatever for a while huh? yeah he was in Angela's for a couple of months it looks like yeah I didn't why I didn't I he he turned off his channel you said. Yeah, that's, I saw somebody say that in the chat room the other day, and I went to see if he still has channels up. He shut them all down. I heard, I heard you and him had some beef. What was that about? Uh, uh, yeah, he did a video on my wife and I, which was totally false and lies. Uh, I just, you know, I just decided not to associate with him. 
I didn't believe in his channel and what he was blabbing about. I didn't really know what Metcal was about, you know, men going their own separate ways. And once I realized what that channel was about, it, I had, I really didn't want anything to do with it. And he got pissed because I wouldn't put, I wouldn't like bring him on like on one of my live streams because that's not what, you know, I wasn't looking for that type of, uh, that's funny flow, right? yeah, that type of, you know, that type of stuff. I think it's called BJ Road, not Street. No. No, BJ Street. A uh, road, you said? Road. R -O -W, BJ road. What's that? There in um, Angeles. He said Terry is the savior of BJ Street. Anyway. Hmm. Close shop. Yeah, Rayman says you close shop altogether. <laughs> well, I mean, if you're going to base your, your uh, channel on Angeles City or... I don't know. He that's that's asking, not the Philippines. He, he I mean, that's. He was asking if he was. Uh, he was asking if he closed the shop. You know. You, well, you I know understand. He's doing a good job, though. The only I, thing I heard about it was um, from um, BAE. Apparently, they had met up, or whatever, and they were helping some girl or something. I mean, I, I watched mm. zero of that guy Terry stuff. I, I don't know what he was doing exactly. Mm. But um, but just what I heard from that. Uh, I, I I always thought he was kind of goofball. I had him on my show once, and everybody like hackled hackled him off the show. Well, he got he got pissed off at us, and it was me and White American Expat and Michael V and all that. We were in a chat. I think it was your chat uh, chat room, Kev. Yeah. And he came in, and somebody was just joking with him, and he's got really thin skin, and none of us blocked. None of us blocked, uh, like he was asking somebody to block these people. And we're like, and Michael V and I think White American Expat said, hey, man, this ain't our channel, even though they had wrenches. It's like, we're not going to block somebody. You know, we may give them a timeout, but that's, you know, it's Kev's channel. So if Kev wants somebody blocked, then he'll just say so. He got pissed off and he blocked all of us at the same day. That's basically why. I mean, we're just laughing. It's like, wow, this guy's whacked out, man. But yeah. anyway. He he, he got mad because I I was telling him don't cuss, and everybody else was cussing all around him. <laughs> yeah, I I don't know, whatever. Don't <clears throat> yeah, to me. just a just a goofy looking person anyway. I mean, we all we all are goofy looking, but no. Hey, speak for yourself, there, buddy. No, hey, no. I seen what you look like too. You know, you, hey, you're, not, at, you're, not, no, at, you're not. You're not. No, you're not. No, like in the hole. Look at it right there. That's me, buddy. I know. Like I said, you're not. You're not a handsome looking guy. Well, I think that's handsome, that's me, probably I'm, you, I'm like a, ten years ago, lost. Me, I'm a guy. Two, two years ago. Come on, that's 10 years ago. Don't lie. No, nah, man, that was two years ago. Yeah, well, you went to hell already then. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> man, look at that. Look at that physique, all right? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not impressed. Me, I, I know I'm a good-looking guy. Really? Who told you that, Kev? Shit. Mary, 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 baby. Was it some Filipina looking for some uh, some money oh, or that, something? That hey, hurts, guapo, that huh? <laughs> she calls me Hanico. <laughs> You're my mahal. <laughs> Send me some money. I love you, no lie. Oh, shit. What's wrong with you, huh? <laughs> shit. Oh, hell. That's my daughter saying that. Daddy, send me money. <laughs> oh, hell. We all can't be good looking like Go-Go Bobo sister. Yeah. Oh, hell, you guys. Yeah. I think she's talking about my beer belly there. Don't make fun of my beer belly. Hey, beer, beer belly is, is money well spent. So they say. I, like I don't drink no more, but you don't drink anymore, Big Cat. No, man, I, I quit drinking when I when I came back to Continental USA. Really? But right. when I was in Guam, I I spent some money when I was in Guam drinking. 
but I drink beer. Beer was too expensive here, or what's the deal? Uh, no, my my aunt, my uncle, my cousins, they they don't drink, so this oh, is don't. no drinking family. So oh. I got to do what they do. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. You know, I ain't, well, cool. I'm I'm at their mercy, so I gotta appreciate where where I'm at. <laughs> yeah, for sure. So, <clears throat> all right, I'm gonna leave you losers alone. Well, I gotta be a loser, Gary. <laughs> yeah, I know. I, I'm not a loser. <laughs> I'll leave both of you losers alone and get the hell out of here before yeah, you guys we were, slam I me. We were pals, man. I we were good friends. Yeah, we we we're gonna give we're you friends. Of party. course, we're friends. Lost time of show. Happy New friends. Year. Hey, hey, hey! Wait a minute. Hold on. We're not friends. Wait a minute. No, we're friends. Why aren't we friends, Lost? Yeah, well, I was going to give you a blanket party. <laughs> I may not be in the same circles as you, Lost, but hey, circles, I, I, I'm still friends with you. you know. What? Uh, what? Who has the same circles? I don't well, you know. Yeah, we all got our own circles, don't we? Yeah, what is this? I mean. Hey, Jerry, what, what is Rain Man saying? What do you say? Yeah, Mexican Jews. Somebody said Mexican Jews in the Philippines. Yeah, you know, I saw um, he had a, he, he did a video earlier. I, I didn't watch the video, but he said he was in the... In the really? Huh. I know I'm not sub to his channel, so I wouldn't know, but maybe yeah, I'll well, check hopefully, out. Hopefully, hopefully he'll get, hopefully he'll get, he'll get rolled. I don't think, uh, Raymond, I don't think he's on disability, is he? He was just working for, like, Well, Coca somebody Cola said he was or, living uh, out of his mother's house. He, well, I have no idea. He, he could be, but I know he had a job, because I talked to him about it, and he was, uh, he was quitting it. Uh, he, now he was in the uh, Navy or something for a while. I have no idea if he gets any money from that. Or but, uh, but I don't think he's on a disability that I'm aware of. Uh. I mean, I don't have, we don't have disability like Gary and, um, and Kev here. I, I don't get disability, Lost. I worked, I worked for what going on. See, by the time I retire this year, It'll be, I think, forty-six or forty-seven years since I. So you're, uh, you're, you'll be sixty-five, or you're. Uh, sixty-two. Retire, uh, 62. Sixty-two. Yep. Yeah. You're a old old guy, guy, aren't you? If you can do it, man. Do it. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm out. I'm done. I can't take it anymore. Yeah, I, I, I know you've been talking about it. I just, I didn't know exactly how old you were. Enough is enough. I hear you. Don't matter what kind of job you have, uh, whether it's a office job or working, uh, you know, in a factory, whatever. It's all the same shit. They all have their own uh, ups know, and downs. Yeah, ups and downs. So one yeah. job is not easier than the other, you know. Yeah, that's true. I work for myself. I do construction work. You know? Yeah. Ha. No, no, Bobo sister. Uh, but I probably could sell some cars. I'm sure if I had to, you know. Jerry smell, uh, sells drugs. Go, go. This way. <laughs> Great lost. Nice. Great. <laughs> a, I bet you, a, I bet you, a, are you DEA? I bet you you're DEA. Are you DEA, <laughs> lost? You're, you're not construction. You're just DEA. <laughs> Undercover right. using construction. That's why, been, uh, that's why I've been following you. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Trying to, trying to move up in the company, trying to make them bust. Mm -hmm. Chicago Kingpin. I don't know why you didn't. Yeah, know. really? Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm tied to the El Chapo, you know, one of his uh, lieutenants. There you go. Uh, I I knew you got an another house that you like. You just use this house, and then when the show's over, you leave and you just go into another room. Well, I got another apartment where I sell drugs out of. Yeah, he, yeah. he had that video. Nice. And if you looked out there to the left, that little bookcase, it opens up and go downstairs. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now you guys know all that's a joke, right? But some people take it out of context, I'm sure. Well, they no, I know. Rain, Rain Man, he'll vouch for it. <laughs> Rain Man's an ice agent, man. <laughs> you're, you're an ice agent. I'm not the ice agent. You're the, Rain Man's an ice agent. Oh, you guys. I, yeah, he's undercover. Uh, all right, you guys. I am uh, going to get off now. All right. Thanks, you guys, for coming on the show. All right. Jerry, always right. a pleasure. Yeah, lost Nomad. All right, Lost. Dave, we had Everybody. Peter on the show. We had Bob on the show. They always bring some spice Nobody cares about to Bob. the show. Nobody cares about who? <laughs>
Bob. Bob. Bob is okay oh, Bob. In, his, in his own. Yeah, that, that was kind of rude. You should let him know next time, just not to just skip out. Like I think it had to be you lost when you it came on. Been. Exactly when I he came left. On, I, I tried to say hello, and he was like, "Oh uh, uh, yeah, that's what happened." It's lost butthole. Nobody hey, Big Kev, you should find out. You should give Bob C a call and say, "Hey, was it lost?" No, maybe, maybe Bob's going to give you a call later on. You know, you know I, actually, you your number, I, I know what it was. I know exactly what happened, right? Peter messaged Bob offline where we couldn't see him. <laughs> threatened Bob and it scared Bob to death because oh. he can do that to people. That could you, know, be. You, you guys got to have some good etiquette. What, All right, you guys, about? if I don't talk to you later on, may, um, have a good... And happy new year. Be yeah, safe. Man, everybody. Yeah, for sure. Everybody have a good, uh, good new year, man. All right. sure. Happy new year's guys. If, I'm most sure. likely, most likely we'll have a show tomorrow, maybe in the afternoon or in the evening time. Well, I'll make sure I'm not around. Because... <laughs> <laughs> all, you got to be doing your Chicago, around. Chicago, uh, Kingpin stuff tomorrow, right? Yeah. There you, you go. Guys are always around when big daddy has a show, you guys will come around. Who's Big oh. Daddy? You calling me Big Daddy? I don't, I don't do any shows. You're not, calling, you're not calling Pete Big Daddy, are you, Big Cat? <laughs> yeah, Peter is Peter is the man. Okay. All right, man. I'll talk to you guys right, later. You guys. Take Always care. a pleasure, you guys. Later. All right. All right, you guys. Later, God bless. Chatters. Yep. Be happy. <laughs>